Okay, y'all, I'm dressed and I'm in a rush because I'm a little behind schedule and I got a bunch of stuff to put in my car. I got all the food. Let me just let me just get it over with. I'm, I'm gonna see y'all at the park. I think I'm gonna make it right before the rain, y'all. If this truck would move in front of me, I would be able to get all of the food out before the rain start. I'm just asking for a favor. God, she's, she's hungry. Come on here, man. Oh, oh, she said, I'm so. Damn, Chris, you ain't come back. Thank you. Put it in there. Oh, yeah. Steve. Man, Look at it, look at it. She said lighting popping. What you gonna tell the people? <laughs> or what she just looking? No, you know what I'm saying? Just let her go along with it. Oh! Stop pulling my hair. Beta! Lighten it up. Run! Oh, Lord. Today is Saturday. Hold on. I'm just trying to show y'all my little fit that I threw together. Wait, I'm headed out the house. I'm just going to get out the house because I don't want to be stuck in the house. Today is Saturday. It's a Saturday after 4th of July. The July. 4th of July kind of threw the weekend off because it was Thursday and now it's the weekend. So it's like, okay, what to do? I think I'm going to go run to TJ Maxx because I've been wanting to go. Okay, let's just go. Let's just go see what they got. so cute it's so cute it's that cute and i love the handle too because i could wear it like this um look at this look at the inside y'all ever bought a top okay don't mind the junk but y'all look at this look if I wore this outfit, this would be the third time that I wore this top. Y'all, I think I got way too many clothing clothing items on this rack. So we're gonna have to remove some stuff because it's doing a little a little shift and lean. Whatever. But I kind of want to show y'all how I'm building my wardrobe. I got some stuff down here. I got the stuff that I bought yesterday. Um, I've been having these shoes. Well, actually, both pair. And, y'all, I've been having these shoes so long. And the fact that I have not worn them yet is really sad. Like, brand new Vans. Then they got, like, a little platform. Y'all, I love these shoes. I got my bowls from yesterday. My new purse. And, y'all, look. I uh, shortened the strap of it. Look at this. I think I want it to be a little longer, but it's cute like this. Close. I'm going to start putting my sunglasses by my purses and shoes so I can start matching up stuff. 
Y'all got this from Marshalls too. Never worn it yet. But I got this purse to match these shoes. So we're going to put that. And I feel like this kind of matches too. That's cute. Freeze. And then I bought this little thing from Goodwill. That came in handy. So now I can finally organize my jewelry. And then I think the next, next step I want to take on building my wardrobe is actually finding shoes and a purse to match this dress because this dress is so cute but haven't worn it yet i need the accessories to go with it um so i'm thinking maybe hunter green like the green i don't know i think that'd be cute that's yes i know y'all just seen me in this shirt yes i know it was just the other day but we wearing these clothes in 2024 okay so I just paired it with some jeans this time instead of shorts and then some pink shoes. I'm about to show you. What y'all think? The glasses do spice it up just a little bit. All right, I'm not excited about going to the grocery store because I gotta get gas, but we're gonna go. We're gonna get gas, we're gonna get groceries. Yes, we got dressed to do that because I don't be having nothing to do, y'all. So that's why we gotta wear shirts two and three times because we'll be having nothing to do. All right, let me go. Y'all, I've been doing so much better with actually making returns. I got two returns over here, and I'm not even ashamed. I'm going to get my money back. Okay, y'all, so I changed my sunglasses because I figured these match more with the shirt. I know the shirt has pink, but this matches more with pink than the white because the white was kind of standing out a little too much for me. All right, let's really go to Walmart. I woke up early this morning just minding my own business, reading my Bible, you know, as I should. And why did I start feeling convicted and guilty about all the shopping I've been doing? Y'all, the amount of stuff that I have, price tag still on it. I ain't never worn it, just got it sitting there looking cute. I just felt this immense amount of, of guilt. And although I will not be returning my things because I like them and I'm keeping them, I was like, yeah, you need to touch grass. Like, <laughs> I needed to get a grip of reality. I was like, I got to do something that costs zero dollars that kind of get me out of my head and want to swipe my debit card because at this point, it's just getting, it's, it's getting out of hand. So... What did I do? I headed to the park. I had a picnic. I ate me some sandwiches, chips, fruit, you know, candy. I read this book, y'all. And then I fought the urge to go buy a new book. And I was like, let's just bring a book that we have and read through it. So I really love this book. So I just kind of read through. I restarted it already. I think I'm on like chapter eight. But yeah, it was so peaceful and nice. And it's definitely something that I need to do more often. I'm just sitting here thinking about like when you're from the country how you really don't care about land because i'm the only person on this hill in this, this area right here if i was in a major city it would be so packed out here but baby we don't care <laughs> it's a lot of it to go around the people is not at the park especially not today they got the splash pad over there they got a couple people and some kids at the splash pad, but that's it. I'm by myself. Ooh, my feet, my legs starting to fall asleep.